Welcome back everybody. Previous videos as you are gone with more and more explanations about the map research here. And uh, I wish to go with some of the problems intermediately. Because problems could be more helpful for the option types. So what I do means so if I just go with the length of length of explanation about the thing, so it could not be helpful for the it might not be helpful, but it may not be going for the tactism to take over the problem. So what I do means I just write the problem right now. And I'm not going to explain about all the steps because these steps will not be helpful for the object and objective type. It could be helpful for theoretical examinations as not for the objective. So in the objective, I want to tell you about the, some shortcuts which will be helpful for taking the answers very easier and within a fraction small moment of time. Okay, so I write the small matrix right now and I wish to get the answer for the matrix within a short step. Okay, just a small and small catalyst. Okay, look at this one, just write, write the problem for you x here and y y and then y x y and then y y x look about this matrix in this matrix there will be having the diagonal elements as x remaining elements are y that means only two elements are there is it right so in the diagonal one element has been arranged and the remaining every that means upper diagonal and lower diagonal other element has been arranged is it right so what I say it means this is a three cross three matrix. Yes, here is it right. So now I will write the answer very directly without solving anything. Previously, what we do, so if we just take a modulus mean, so we used to go for look at this one, x into x square minus y square, and then minus y into xy minus y square, etc. We may go for solving the more things by expanding the whole matrix. So try. We don't require for this one because we aren't going for any theoretical examination because we are instead we are going for the objective type. So I wrap up everything here and only for you I will write the last step. So this last step could be helpful for solving a problem very easy with a fraction of moment. Okay, I'll write here and this will be the x plus 2y into x minus y the whole square. This is the answer. Okay, this is the exact answer. Look about this one, so you don't get panic. But how you want to make you this answer to get into the mind very strongly? Just tell you some clue. Okay, so look at it here. For some of these questions, shortcut will give you shortcut will help you to get solve in any type of competitive exam, including the carriage. Okay, so here one x is available. Is it right? Two y's are there. So get the clue. Okay, it's not like mugging up. It's like a clue. So that you can able to get the solve, get the solution very easy. So x plus 2y, x plus 2y into who are their difference between first one element and another element. Is it right? X minus y, two elements are right. So you make a square. Is this a clue? Okay, you take the first row. If, if this type of matrix if you face, so first element, two elements are available, right? So add the two elements. Okay? And Two elements are totally available, is it right? So what's the difference? Minus y and two elements of the right square. Okay. What are my because this is my way of clue. You can have any type of clue, but whatever it might be, you just study this answer. I just get the answer very strongly in your mind as a of the nailed hammer. Okay. So study this action. Now I get it to go for a problem. Look at over here. So here one, two, two. Or uh, they say, oh, I'm going for some other way, so I'm going for 1 to 2. I'm going to go for 1, 3, 3. That ought to be right. 1, 3, 3. And 3, 1, 3. And 3, 3, 1. Look at here. Here, x is equal to 1. Y is equal to 3. Is it right? Yeah, sure. So, we apply this in the formula. Okay. So, 1 plus 2 into what's y? 3. Okay. And into... What is minus y? 1 minus 2, the whole square, which is equal to 1 plus 2 and 3 is 6. And multiplied by minus 1, the whole square, is equal to 7 into, what's minus 1 square is 1, because any negative amount will be carrying the square means it will be going over past you. Into 1, which is equal to 7. This is the answer, okay? You got the answer right. Fraction of second, you do this complete solution. We don't want to go for, okay, one into 
uh, then one minus nine and then minus three and two. You don't please don't go by that way. Okay, this is the complete solution. This is the clue solution for everything to solve any complete actions. Okay. Also, one more thing I'll tell you. Please wait. I wrote this one. I think God is right. If you don't write means no problem, just stop the video wherever it is available and then just write them and then you just go, okay?